Well, well, well. I've just come back into my office from the meeting held today with the whole veterans and the first lady. Um, we're in after having been saying it uh, in all these days and having been in a position where she now feels it's about time to make the statement public, the first lady informed us that my Mujuru should resign. So uh, unfortunately, uh, <laughs> with our current system, uh, people uh, sometimes don't want to resign. They want to hang on to power. So we'll see what, how this happens. But the logical thing for anybody to do sensibly would be to hand over her resignation to the president on the allegations that we have all had. I trust that that should be democracy. A person should stand down when there has been a lot of expose and regroup and come back again into the structures of the organization and the party and claim a place back if that is necessary. Um, yeah, I say this uh, because I was there, I had it. It's going to be on the news and this is the field news. Africa and the world. That's how it revolves, eh? Somewhere there in Africa, there's Ebola. Somewhere there in the United States or Canada, they are terrorists. Somewhere there in the United States of America, is a man called Barack Obama who slaughtered Santos to Zimbabwe. And that's the whole sea there. Huh? There's more water on earth than there is land, eh? Anyway, let's preserve the land that we have. All we have is Zimbabwe. Good evening. Have a good night, everybody. Yours, Dr. PC. Cheers.